In the last couple of years, I was just like, to hell with it. <laughs> <laughs> so I just started really uh, just wanting to be myself more and more and having fun with it. So how did you get into boudoir? So for me, I, um, I kind of started this whole photography journey out of, out of the blue. Um, I was always working uh, in construction, kind of in the trades, and I was never a girly girl. I was always jeans and a, like a band t-shirt or something. I don't know, just super random. But I knew that I loved photographing women, um, and I, but I wasn't sure where that was going to take me because it was... Um, People will tell you, you just have to photograph everything um, to make money as a photographer. Hmm. And what I was kind of starting to figure out is the nichier I got, the better it was. The better it was for talking about Lady Lux Studios and what my mission was. And um, it just gave me a better direction. Your company is called Lady Lux Studios. Yes. How was that inspired? Actually, I started my company because we had to create a business uh, while I was going to school. <laughs> so it was one of our projects we had to do. And I was always inspired by um, vintage and uh, like tattoos and old Hollywood. It was the beginning of my, um, without even realizing it, it was the beginning of a transformation for me is, is naming my company Lady Lux Studios. So, transformation. Yeah. What was what was that about and when did this happen? When I look back, I guess it is fairly long, <laughs> fairly long journey. But um, for me, I always um, thought I had to hide certain parts of myself, this sort of fun side of, of being a woman. And uh, I slowly started to buy the clothes that I liked and wear my hair the way that I wanted to, but only around certain people. And so I would kind of stuff it away. In the last couple of years, I was just like, to hell with it. <laughs> <laughs> so I just started really uh, just wanting to be myself more and more and having fun with it and not taking it so serious, you know? Like the clothes you wear, they don't define you as a person, right? It's just, it's fun. And being a woman is fun. We get to do fun things. As I mentioned, boudoir photography, it really does put you out of your comfort zone, but it also does something else magical that I really want you to talk about, that you get to see the transformation in, in women and in other people. Yes. So tell me about that. So um, with boudoir photography, it is more often than not, I, you know, women come through the door and they're very nervous and they're, oh my God, I just about canceled two days ago. I was going to cancel. I just, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> what? Yeah, yeah ex exactly. Right. So I, I get that a lot. Or, I don't have anything to wear. <laughs> yes. There's a lot of excuses that come up when you're mm -hmm. about to do something that's scary. Right. Then really what happens is the women show me, um, kind of what direction they want to go into. And so not every session is the same, and I don't photograph every woman the same. And there's an energy that comes across, and it is sexy, and confident, and amazing, and freeing, and it's my favorite thing to photograph because it is a moment, and I think that's that's what you know sexy is. Like being with you, we got to that place. Like I was yes, just yeah. right in it to win yeah. it. Yeah, it's a different experience, right? And, was... and you not allowing yourself to be fully in that moment makes a huge difference, right? And uh, I mean, that's that's okay too, right? It's the experience and the hair and the makeup and everything, it's amazing, but it's what happens after. Like you take mm -hmm. that energy out into the world, into your next project, into your relationship. And you know, a lot of women will, they'll come for their session and they'll go out in the evening, right? Cause they just feel amazing. Yeah. Yeah, when you feel, it's that, that sexual energy, when you feel empowered and amazing about yourself, it just, all the other stuff doesn't matter. Now, could you imagine just turning that on every day and you didn't have to worry about all that other stuff? Hey everybody, thanks so much for watching. If you like these videos and want to join us on our ride of our web series, Life of a Producer, then like and subscribe here. Right here. That's right. You got it. <laughs>